Good morning. Beautiful morning in the Carolinas. A little overcast actually, but beautiful nonetheless. Heading to a listing appointment over in Concord today. But the reason I'm doing this video is I found out something the other day in our legislative meeting for North Carolina Realtors and wanted to share it with you. There is a forbearance option out there if you are not able to make your mortgage payments now and you are a FHA, VA, um, USDA, Fannie Mae, Freddie Mac, Jenny Mae loan, which is probably 75% of loans that are out there are government loans like that. There is forbearance options that were provided in the CARES Act so that you can contact your lender and without even proving you have a hardship at all, you can actually do a forbearance. And a forbearance means that you are not going to make payments for a certain amount of time. And they will put those payments on the back side of your mortgage. And my understanding is in the CARE Act, originally it was 180 days. Um, I found out through another source yesterday that... It seems like there's a provision that it could go an additional 180 days. So possibly up to a year of not making payments. Now, originally, I thought this was really going to be an issue because it does affect your credit if you do a forbearance. It shows up that you have not been making your payments. And obviously, that's going to prevent you from buying something else if you sell your house or... I uh, want to refinance because you haven't been making your payments. But I found out in our legislative forum the other day that the CARES Act evidently has been modified and the lender, when they give you the forbearance, they must continue to mark your payment as paid on time with the credit bureau. So that means that if you are in need of doing the forbearance, you still look like you're actually making your payment on time as long as you hold up your end of the bargain of the forbearance um, so i want to pass that along i think that's very interesting i think that's a great provision because obviously it would be very bad if all these people that are having to do forbearance which i hear about seven to eight percent of mortgages are currently in forbearance through this program so that's a significant amount if you have any questions on that, um, reach out to me. And if you have had your lender do a forbearance for you and it's showing up on your credit file that you are not paying on time, you need to contact them and let them know they must mark it as paid on time with the credit bureau through the, the edit that was made to the CARES Act. And after making that contact, if you do have an issue, please reach out to me because I'd like to share that with our state representatives in the real estate commission well in north carolina uh, realtors that um, have been working on this very hard through our our pack dollars and such to get this legislation uh, changed um, so if you have any issues with it give me a call i'd like to put that at the totem pole and let people know if there is an issue if you have any questions about real estate, don't hesitate to give me a call. As a matter of fact, I would love if you called me. I love talking about real estate. 704-360-0667. Have a great week.